Hey guys, from Luke here today and welcome back to Cities Skylines where changes have indeed taken place. So, I went through on this little road, uh, kept some of it the same, but I expanded this little section here just because that was the easiest to do. And it also allowed me to give, you know, dedicated turning lanes to entering or exiting uh, the highway down below, which has actually helped out quite a lot. Uh, didn't bother revamping that bit, haven't really needed to. Following the road along, uh, at this point here where these two highways actually join, it turns into a six lane, as per your suggestions in the comments. Um, I was going to do another little interchange kind of thing here, but it turns out just doing traffic lights here actually works perfectly fine. Uh, and also with the six lane road, we can get that nice turning lane in there quite easily. So that's good enough. Uh, over here now, you may notice I've actually changed this into a cargo hub. I don't know if anyone actually suggested this. They might have been a previous epi episode at some point. But, you know, prior to this, we had a cargo train station there and then a sort of cargo harbor there. Instead, you know, Cargo Hub, we can get the trains and the ships uh, into the same place, and then we don't have to have those stupid number of roads that connected everything together. Also, I moved the recycling center from over there to here just because it, you know, made more sense and required one less road. Uh, so, you know, it worked a lot better. I uh, actually had this little road built around this way just so cars and trucks coming out of the, uh, the Cargo Hub there can actually you know, turn around, go that way, instead of having to cut across traffic and turn right. Some of them still do cut across, but, you know, it works pretty well for the most part. Then, of course, the next change is this bridge. is uh, the full six-lane bridge that goes all the way across. I changed um, the intersection here with pine. Uh, so instead, yeah, again, it's just a, a set of traffic lights, which actually works pretty damn well. I uh, haven't had many problems with it, except for that guy right there. There we go. Uh, so instead of entering into the town there, they either go that way or they can come up this way and go across that little bridge there. And that's actually seemed to have worked pretty well, except for right now, uh, for <laughs> some reason. Uh, no, that's not too bad. It's not too bad. Uh, now, I'm wondering if a lot of people in this lane uh, actually get... I want to see if a lot of people change out of this lane. Uh, no, I think most of, oh, some of them are changing out there. I, yeah, and there's a guy changing there too. I just want to, if they're going to go straight ahead, I would like them to change out of that lane earlier, because otherwise then we get unnecessary traffic sitting in that lane. So I would like them to change as far back as I can, which I guess would be back here. So, they can't even change lanes there either. Where would they have to get? Oh, okay, they'd have to get in the lane back here. And then these guys would just have to turn into the correct... Yeah, so then that would just force them into the correct... I don't know if that's going to help, but it seems kind of annoying how they keep changing uh, way too late. Anyway, so yeah, I changed that bridge up there. Now you may notice... Ooh, what's going on up here? We changed this a little bit. We've got a couple of roads coming out of here. Uh, yeah, so I've read, read on this bit here. Before, this used to connect up here and have like a little interchange. Uh, completely changed that because as you'll note, that I have added a brand new bridge over here. So this is a brand new six-lane bridge that connects up to the bottom of Hemlock. And it also actually continues underground there as a highway. Because this, this has become a highway now. If we have a look uh, underground... It's not very neat, but, you know, we don't see it, so I didn't really care. Anyway, so it comes up here and then has a little interchange there underground. Uh, and that actually allows quite a lot of traffic to flow through that way across this brand new bridge that comes to this revamped intersection. Now, this intersection is a little messy. I'm not, I'm not going to lie. It works, though. It works very well. I, I This is actually the revision. This is like the second or third revision of this intersection. And this is the best looking one I came out with. So that's the one I'm sticking with. Anyway, so that was, that's what I could do. So yeah, obviously this highway was always here before, but it only connected up to that one. Uh, so instead I decided to add, chuck in another bridge there, because that allows everyone from uh, the city area, they can either go through that way, onto that bridge, or they can come down this highway and come across this way uh, to get over here, depending on where, they, the, the, where they're going, you know. Uh, and I also added, you may know, a little connection here just for the other side of uh, King Park, so they don't all have to go to this interchange. They can come up this way and go either way there. So that's what I spent a lot of time doing, was mainly this intersection, trying to figure out how to make that work properly. And it turned out quite well. Uh, I feel like there's something else I did, but I'm not sure. Yeah, no, I know I spent a lot of time doing that, <laughs> and, and that tunnel there, and then obviously that bridge over there. I didn't touch anything over that side. Uh, hmm, I think that might be it in terms of what I did. Did I do anything? Oh yeah, I put these back. I uh, put these little uh, walkways back here. Oh, those trees are like dying because the water's too close to them. Anyway, yeah, so I put those uh, little walkways back because that was kind of annoying me. I... did I do anything here? No, I think... oh, I actually removed the traffic lights there because I was backing up. So I was like, yeah, let's get rid of the traffic lights. Now, I think, yeah, I think that's all I did. Oh, I did actually mess around with these train lines a little bit, so... 
instead of them crossing over there, they actually cross over this side. So that obviously crosses above and that just goes underneath. Uh, and I think, now I think that's it. I did, yeah, so I did a little bit of train work. Uh, yeah, no, I think that's it. I, I do indeed think that is it. Obviously, yeah, I had to relay these train lines. If you notice anything I've missed or something I bulldozed that I forgot to put back, because I did change a lot of stuff, that'd be really helpful if you let me know. Oh, uh, actually, yeah, someone mentioned in the comments last time that I forgot to flip one of these roads around. They should all be going the right way now. Um, yeah, so that's down, that's entrance. That's, yeah, that should be fine. That looks all pretty good now. Cool, all right, so this episode, I want to go back over this side of Caps Lock and sort of fill in this little area here. Uh, also, because we have a lot of residential demand and there's not enough workers over in that area. Oh, actually, you know what? No, 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 no. What we need to do first is get the, the fusion coil. Um, I keep calling it a fusion coil. I don't know why. Anyway, it's the fusion power plant. That's all we need to get. We're going to chuck it out here. Uh, I'm actually going to get rid of the nuclear plant. Uh, I'm actually going to move that. Now. How much does that cost to move? 20,000. I'm going to chuck that there. That's going to go there. Okay, so that is obviously going to take care of all of our power needs. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of uh, our other... Do we have any other... We, I don't think we do. I think it was... I think it was just the dam and the nuclear plant. I think that's all we had. Because I think I removed them all before. All the solar plants. And there's nothing else that produces power. Okay, so we'll keep the dam, obviously, just for the aesthetic value. And it looks kind of cool. So we'll keep that. But now what we can do, because we're producing so much power... We can save a crap ton of money on the budget. Let's just put that all the way down. Now, I don't know, where's all my money going these days? It used to get like plus 60,000. I'm not quite sure where it's all going. I don't know. Anyway, even, you know, at like 50% budget, we're still producing 4,000 megawatts, which are only 1,000, so that's plenty of power. So we don't need to worry about that anymore. Is there anything else we want in here? Space elevator. I don't really want that. Medical center would be good. Oh, uh, that's always... I feel like these buildings are so cheaty, but I still want them. I still want them. Let's have a look. So, medical center, what do we need? Construction, construct mall of moderation. Um, we might put it over here, because this is kind of like the, you know, this is like the entertainment area anyway, isn't it? So why don't we get the mall around here somewhere? We get some bicycle lanes. I don't know why this doesn't have bicycle lanes. No, I didn't do that. Definitely should have them. Uh, so that's going to come through to there. Looks good to me. And then we can get in some... Uh, let me get a pathway. Let me turn off snapping, because I want it right there. Oh, that's curved. Go right, straight through there. Just a little bit of a shortcut, so I don't have to walk around. That'll be nice. Then we can go ahead and get our Mall of Moderation. Uh, which is one of these. Mall of Moderation, there it is. And go right there, so opposite the pathway. Looking good. Get a little, uh, oh. Wish that would go right in the middle. Oh, and it's disappeared. <laughs> there it is. Okay, so then we had... Oh yeah, the other thing I want to do is get the, all the bus lines in now, because people keep telling me to do this, and I have, be, I have been meaning to do them, I promise. Uh, people aren't driving straight across there, are they? No, they're not. Okay, I thought I saw a car go straight across, but I didn't. Yeah, no, I was, I was trying to figure out where I could put in the bus terminal, because I do want to use the bus terminal. Also, those trees are actually really annoying me. That is uh, annoying me a lot. And the way to fix that is just to bring up a little bit of land there. That didn't help. Damn it. <laughs> oh well, those trees are destined to be dead, and now we've got a little bit of land showing. Land ho! Yeah, so we need to, first of all, put that back. We need more residential. Uh, city is looking very nice now, it's starting to fill in quite quite well. Uh, yeah, the hills are filled out nicely. I put some trees in there as well, because those cliffs looked awful without trees in it. But now they've got, got nice little houses there. Uh, I definitely think we can get some more housing over here. Why don't we go... See if we can get this road. Obviously that's going to be quite steep, but we might be able to go this way. And then, if we get rid of the trees, because I don't think we'll need them. Like this. And then, maybe that will connect up to that little highway section there. Yeah, I just want to get some more hill homes up here. Now that's not a big enough area for my liking, so let's see if we can just level out some more of that, just so we can get... At least, at least two tile homes usually look pretty good. So, that's what I'm going to try and go for here. Uh, yeah, so at least two tiles of zonable space is ideal. Definitely bring that back a little bit in there, and then there. Uh, that bit should be fine. 
Get a little bit more space. I guess we should do the ramp tool because that would help out. There we go. Uh, then what we're going to do is just adjust the road quickly. So it, the zoning updates. Oh, look at all the zoning we have now. Stunning. It's good. Okay, so that road will go up like that. Uh, hopefully no one's going to use that as an actual road to drive on. <laughs> I guess I might do if I connect it up down here, which is exactly what I'm going to do. Uh, can that go straight? Oh, well, don't, don't bridge it though. I guess if we go... Like this? Oh, we can connect it there, but that's not ideal. I want it a little bit further along. Hang on. Let's see if we can go... Let's get rid of the trees. Hang on. Yeah, I get, I get the slope's too steep, but I want to... Hang on, where was that? That can go there. That's not going to work. I think that's just going to have to be a separate road. Now, can that not build a bridge, please? That can go there, but we don't have any zoning. I guess we can add some in. Hang on. I guess I should also slow down time. There's no, there's no point to be going maximum speed here. Uh, hang on, let's go... Like that. And then to there. Oh, yeah, it looks pretty dodgy, but that's okay. We'll, we'll make it look a little bit neater in a second. Uh, so that's going to come around there. And I want to make sure this still has... Oopsie daisies. <laughs> I want to make sure this still had space up the top. And then I'm just going to adjust these roads again, just to update it a little bit. Looks like it updated down here too, but it didn't. There we go. We'll have trees all down there, and I'll think... Uh, you know what? No, we're going to change it to cycle lanes. So you can cycle, cycle down. Be nice. All around here. I don't even know if this is in a, uh... Is this in a thing though? A district? Oh, it is. Okay, so it's in Caps Lock CBD, so this is going to be all... Uh, do we want to go... I don't think I want to go for... High density. Ah, but do I want to go low density? Do we have high-tech housing on? Because that would be okay. Hey, let's have a look. Maybe we should go high-tech hou high housing? I don't know why I said it like that, but I did! Uh, let's go... High-tech. I wonder if that's going to change any of the, the skyscrapers. I don't think it did, so that's fine. Good, I just didn't want everything to get destroyed there. Uh, so this, we're going to have housing along this side as well. Oop, not exactly prestigious housing, because it's not a very big area anyway. And especially because it's next to that sort of highway and the train line there, but... It's just a place to live. Just a place to live. We might get some... No, I was going to say we might get some parks in, but they have that bloody thing right there. They have a lot of, like, awesome buildings nearby, so I don't think they need any... more good-looking stuff. And then when we get down the bottom, we might just turn that into commercial. Around the bottom of the road. So all this is going to be our residential. Does that have water? It does not. I didn't think it would. I can go up to there. Okay, yeah, you have water. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, shut up for a second there. Uh, so this can uh, definitely have a road... ...going through over that way. I guess that doesn't have to be a highway anymore. Might as well turn it into a zonable section. And also, I don't know why... Why do we randomly choose that spot to do it? Should be more like that, shouldn't it? Hopefully, is that building still accessible? It is. Good, I don't want to move that. Uh, yes, yeah, so that's fine. And then it turns into the sort of high-speed highway. Uh, but we'll get commercial around here, I think. Especially because there's more commercial demand anyway. Uh, not around that bit, though. So around here, maybe down that bit as well. Uh, and that can be a house, I think. That'll be good. All right, so now we've got some people living up there. I'm sure I'm sure they like it. Do you have everything you need? Oh, <laughs> you do not. We could use some police up here. Oh, actually, what was the other thing that we needed? Oh, we already have this? Medical center? Okay, well. Oh, Jesus. Jesus, that's ugly. Why are these buildings always so ugly? <laughs> I guess it's going to go over here as well. What I want to do, why don't we, instead of having that go straight up like that, because I want, I, want I want an interesting skyline. This is called City Skylines, after all, so... Why don't we go that way? Can I place the building there? Of course I can't. <laughs> of course I can't. Uh, it's just a little too uneven. Which if we just... If we smooth that out, might be okay. Good thing we have crap tons of money. So if we just make that all a ramp there... Maybe it'll be more willing to place there, let's see. Oh, it is. Beautiful. So why don't we get that in there? Uh, sure. I don't know, we, we might move that later on. Don't worry, it's City Skylines. Everything's subject to change. 
there. Okay, that will go through there. So now we don't need... I think that we just gets rid, rid of the need for hospitals, doesn't it? This medical center provides health healthcare for the whole city. If I could stop stumbling over my words. So why don't we go ahead... I don't want to get rid of... Okay, so here's the thing. I don't want to get rid of all the hospitals because some of them, you know, are in just nice positions. They, they look aesthetically nice. Uh, but then a lot of them I just don't want to have anyway. So we'll just go through and get rid of all these. These are unnecessary. Uh, you have no health care, but you should do now anyway. From that. Uh, yeah, so we'll get rid of that. I don't like any of these ones. Mainly because they're just little buildings we place around the place. I think the ones that will be... That will keep... Uh, definitely not that one. That's crap anyway. All the little ones. I think the one in Dean looks okay. Like it looks kind of nice where it is. If I'm not mistaken. I may be mistaken. Let's go have a look. Uh, Umbar, I'll get rid of that one. So they're not like centerpieces or anything, but I think in Dean, like I like the hospital there, I think. I think that's the one I was specifically re referencing in terms of looking good. Yeah, I don't mind that one there. I like that one. I'm going to keep one and it's going to be that one there. So let's go ahead and get rid of all the others. Which we no longer need. I wish it took care of um, death care as well. That'd be nice. Get rid of that one. Okay, so... Oh, that one's actually not bad either. I don't mind that one, sort of, because you got all these little, like, low-rise, high-density buildings in, like, the hospital in the middle. It looks kind of cool. I'll keep that one, too. Um, let's have a look. So, yeah, then we got that one. Okay, we don't, definitely don't need the ones up here. Let's get rid of that. The one over there. And the one over there. Okay. Now, so that's where that building is. We have, should have two hospitals. Yep. You guys have noise pollution now, but shouldn't you be taken care of by the other building? If we're going to have, like, massive noise pollution problems, then what's the point of... Yeah, everyone's having noise pollution now. I thought the whole point of that building was to take care of my healthcare. Provides healthcare for the whole city. Maybe it doesn't mean it's... any good at doing it. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have got rid of everything. Okay, why don't we... go through and place hospitals back? <laughs> well, I thought that was supposed to like, but now people are complaining about noise. So clearly it hasn't done a very good job. Get that back in there. There's a big nice spot for it there. Hmm. Well, may have preemptively removed all the hospitals. So there's that. What was that one? There? I don't know. Probably. I won't, I'm not going to put too many in. Uh, definitely not going to be too many of these in, but... Go through. Pine didn't have a big hospital either, which is interesting. It will now, though. It's gonna go right there. Uh, you guys, Hemlock seems fine. That's not an inherently noisy place, which is okay. Out in Glade. Can I fit a big hospital there? That would be kind of nice. We do have a big empty space in the middle of Glade for some reason. <laughs> I don't know. We left it as like a little greenery. There's no noise, com uh, noise pollution complaints there, though, so I don't really care about you guys. Now, you guys are complaining. Uh, might get a big hospital in the middle of Umber here. Although, they seem to be getting so- Like, there's a lot of ambulances around, because you can see them all driving there. So maybe we don't need to worry about it. Ah, oh, let's do it anyway. Let's get it in. There you go. It'll just make people generally happier, I think, so... Whatever. Okay. That's in. Now, back over here, where we were before. Uh, how come I didn't zone any of that? I don't know, but let's zone it. There we go. Uh, do we want to... So that's for school. Okay, we, we want to get some schools around here, I think. Why don't we get a road? I'll continue this road over here. Uh, coming down this way. So that goes there. Uh, and then... We can go straight along. Oh, that road's a little bit longer than we can... Just intersect them nicely like that. Can that go under? Oh, not at that angle. Can get under there, though. Do I want it to go there? I don't know. Maybe, maybe people will use it. Maybe they won't. We'll find out. Get rid of that bit. Gotta love gotta love the bike lane roads. I really do like them. Uh, this area, however, can be this road to there. Is that going to destroy that building? Or is that fine? I think it's fine. And then that can go... There. Alright. Then we get nice little, uh... Sort of alley buildings in here. 
maybe we can get in offices in that space and get commercial there. Get some commercial in there too. Alright, and then this area. Oh, you don't have any water? Oh, that's my bad. There you go, buddy. Not a great way to do water, but like they're very haphazardly laid out. Oh yeah, bus bus lines. Now, the thing with this is, because this is like a big bus terminal where a lot of buses are going to exchange. I was going to put it in here. But first of all, it's going to look, it doesn't look good. So I'm thinking we might need to shuffle some things around. Uh, oh, actually, now that that's gone, maybe we can chuck it in here. The hospital that was here. Can I? Damn it. If we move the fire station. Uh, if we move the fire station, maybe... Oh, jeez, that does not have good fire coverage over there. Why don't we move this over... Hmm. <laughs> There's really nowhere to put it. We can put it in the university? It's not ideal, though. I think we're just going to destroy some of these buildings here. Get out of my way. Thank you. Then we can get the bus terminal in here. Uh, and then, then it's not too much of a walk from the actual station. And I think, yeah, we have a subway station over there too, so it's not far from that, which is good. And then we can start sorting out the buses. The other thing I wanted to do was get the fire department over here, because it's absolutely awful. For some reason, there's no coverage. <laughs> I've clearly not paid attention to that. Uh, we'll get it on this main road there. Okay, that makes all those guys happy. Much better. Oh, Jesus. Might get some old firehouses in here too. Uh, I thought we used to have one around here. Oh, I guess we didn't. <laughs> well, obviously we didn't, otherwise there wouldn't be a problem. For some reason I thought we did. Uh, that's gonna go right about there. That'll make all of those guys happy. Let's just have a look around. Uh, you guys aren't too happy either. Mm. Maybe just a small fire hoose for you guys. Get one down there by the water. That's a nice little one. University also doesn't have much fire coverage. But, you know, screw them. Not great there. That's awful. That's also pretty bad, but whatever. That's fine. It's mostly okay now. Mostly okay. Alright, so... Get some houses along here. Oh, it's, a nice, it's a nice little area to live along here, I think. This guy's cycling, and that'd be pretty fun to cycle down. Cycling back up, maybe not as fun. Maybe not as fun. Okay, so... I'm wondering... So we need more commercial, obviously. Just having a look where we could put some more... I mean, we have this area over here we could do. Where where do we have a like a kind of lack of commercial? I guess is a better question. Where could they use more? I don't know. Maybe up just up in here along this road that we never zoned anything on. Get some commercial for these guys. There you go. Yeah, why not? Why not? Because it's probably a bad idea. That's why not. But we'll we'll get it in there anyway. Yeah, it's so probably we'll create some unnecessary traffic for the area. No, I mean, not that we already... We don't already have traffic, we totally do, but... We'll create some more. Okay, oh, okay. Looking good. How is this, uh, this highway running on here? The only problem I have with it is I think... It's not so bad now, but I think a lot of people... Jump in that left lane. But that's obviously because they're turning onto the road. What are you doing? Alright. There we go. Uh, it's actually not as bad as I thought it was, so that's fine. I thought it was worse than that. Maybe it was a different road. Maybe it was this one I'm thinking of. No, even this is fine. They're using all three lanes. It's actually quite good. That's actually pretty damn good. They're using, like, all the lanes beautifully, and that's holding up well. Yeah, no, that that, um, that road upgrade actually helped out a lot. I'm glad I spent my time on that. <laughs> okay. So we got the bus terminal in, wherever it was. There it is. It's actually a pretty good location in the end. Now, do we want to get subway lines in? Because now... We have a situation where we kind of have a subway line that doesn't cover any of that part of the city. Also, none of this section is covered by subways. But we can cover it by buses, so maybe we'll do that instead. So let's go from there. And uh, then we're going to come out. Oh, Jesus. Can you not turn right there? What's going on there? I don't know why you can't turn right. You should be able to turn right there. Definitely should be able to turn right there. Oh, let me get rid of that. Uh... All right. Well, obviously you can't, so let's not go that way. Let's go this way. Um, so it's going to come out. Uh, I guess we'll try and fill in some areas where... Subways aren't, really, is what we're trying to do, isn't it? So why don't we go in this way? Come up this way. 
Go up through here. And then come up into the industrial area, which also doesn't have a train station, which is probably a good idea to go through. I'm going to bust that way, and then this will come up to there. I like how we still have that train line underground. I should probably get rid of that. This is going to come through via the Mall of Moderation. Actually, I guess we should... No, we will go. We'll go here because they can walk through. Via the Mall of Moderation. Up around the hills. Actually, why don't we go like this? So we're going to go up around the hills. I'm actually going to literally go around the hills area. Uh, we'll only have one stop there. That'll be fine. Um, then we're going to double back on ourselves. So it's going to be the same line that sort of just comes back this way. Uh, it goes back around. Just trying to mirror all the stops. Instead of setting it up as two lines, which I normally do, which I feel like is a bad way to do it, because it makes... I think it makes more work for me doing it that way. Now, can we get back into the stop this way? We can't. We have to go around, but that's not that's not so bad. So we can go in like that. I don't know why they can't turn across the road there. I'm not quite sure why. But anyway, so what we're going to do, let, let's name this now before we forget and get confused. Caps lock. Bus terminal. Good. And then we're going to have a look at our bus that will spawn somewhere. I don't know where it's spawned, actually. Oh, from the bus depot, which would be somewhere. Maybe we should get one around here. Because I don't think we have one around here. Have one up? It's probably spawned from there, hasn't it? I <laughs> bet that's where it's come from. Alright, let's get one of these in. One of these guys! Uh, it's not going to fit anywhere useful. Oh, anywhere nice. Maybe... Because this is kind of an industrial zone over here. Oh, we got rid of the hospital here. Why don't we chuck it in there? So this is going to be Caps Lock Bus Depot. Then let's go to our... Oh, this is great. Doing a lot of public transport now. This is great stuff. We haven't done buses in a long time. Bus line 36, which I presume is this one, uh, will be day and night. Sure, why not? Depot is going to be Caps Lock Central. Oh, we have a Cap... We do have a Caps Lock Bus Depot? I guess that would make sense because I probably put one down before. But where is it? Oh, is that it? Oh, okay, that's probably it there. Okay, no, 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 mind. Let's get rid of that one. <laughs> My bad! Alright, that's gonna be commercial there. Because we have a little bit of demand, and that can be residential. Uh, and then we'll, yeah, we'll go back to fulfilling demand in a minute. Uh, we've got a lot of space there too. Let's zone that. Any, if there's any obvious spaces, I'll just zone it quickly. Uh, obviously not zoning along the expressway. There's a big gap in there. Um, we could zone all this as residential, but I don't know if I want to. Definitely not high density. Oh, maybe high density. I guess I don't mind. Maybe that is high density, that side of the road. And then this can be low density. I don't know, we'll see what that looks like. It might look stupid. Anyway, uh, back to the bus line. Yeah, so Caps Lock Central is where we wanted to come from, because that was fine, actually. Uh, Caps Lock Central. So, we're going to use regular buses, I think. Should we? Yeah, because it's kind of like the, the modern kind of city. This is going to be all our city bus lines going through this terminal. Uh, for the most part, I think. Sure, why not? Let's get a bunch of buses. I don't know how many... How many do we need? Because this should actually... Hang on. Enable vehicle unbunching. Yeah, let's do that. If I'm bunching it... All right, wait, if I'm bunching aggression is set to zero, this setting has no effect. Well, where's the setting for it? Is it like... I don't know where it would be. I don't know. I don't know how many buses we're going to need. Let's go... Let's get eight and see how that kind of loops around. Probably more than that because it's going to go up and then back around. Why don't we get... Let's go ten. Uh, let's also name this. So this is going to be... Do we have any... I don't think we have any Caps Lock bus lines, do we? No, it doesn't look like it. So it's going to be... Caps Lock-001. Uh, the line... Oh, I didn't press enter. Damn it. Caps Lock... Dash 001. The bus line color. I don't know. I guess it can. It doesn't really matter because as long as it's not, we're not interfering with other bus lines, which we're not really. It doesn't really matter what color we make it, to be honest. Uh, but what should we make it? How about like a lime? Let's go lime. But not offensively lime. Actually, it kind of has to be offensive, otherwise it just looks like shite green. So let's make an offensive lime. All right. Oh, damn it! I didn't press enter again. That's actually really annoying. Uh, oh, good. Caps Lock actually appears at the top, too. That's actually really useful. Okay, let's go back to Lime. Make it offensive Lime. Enter. There you go. That's what you wanted. Alright, so now we should... Oh, look at all the people waiting there. They're loving it! 
I don't know where the buses are though. <laughs> they should be coming from over here, but I don't know where they are. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's see if I can find one. Should be an offensive lime color somewhere. Could be up around here. Oh, there it is. Oh, nice. They carry 55 people, not too bad. Uh, where's... There's one as well coming back. Yeah, because they come back the same way, don't they? On they get. Alright, is that the furthest forward bus? I think so, then the rest... Oh, I guess... I wonder if... Maybe they, they start from the nearest stop. Is that one heading back? Yeah, that one's heading back. Okay, any in, any in front of that? I don't... Oh, yeah, there is. There's one up here. Okay, so there's almost one there. It just has to loop around. I guess, actually, if we're looping around... No, no, no. I was going to do a stop over here, but there's no point. We've got a whole bus terminal now. I was going to... Yeah, let's not do that. So the bus should be somewhere through here, right? There it is. 16 passengers. Cool. All right. I'm, I'm just making sure this bus line's working how we want it to. And then that will come on through. Stops there. Um, cool. Uh, I mean, that, that should work quite well. I think I'm going to leave it here. I'm going to have the episode, episode fairly short today. But, I'll leave your comments and suggestions. I might actually do some more bus lines between episodes, because they, they can be quite tedious to sort of, <laughs> sort of go through. But let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments down below. I'll see you next time, and have an awesome day.